Hello, welcome to the final level of Super Mario Land 2, Wario Castle. Now, someone in the internet asked me if I could show off this level because it was Wario's first appearance. And I decided, you know what, why not? Now, here's the thing about the commentary though. My co-commentator Holiday is a bit of a busy man, so I decided to not ask him for this and try my hand at solo commentary. So, I am actually going to talk a bit about the level itself. Wario Castle is a level in which the difficulty curve suddenly spikes up awkwardly a huge amount. Super Mario Land 2 in general is just a very easy game, but as you saw in that previous floor for example, some of the jumps there were really hard to time. That's, that room isn't as devilish as the second floor here. Now, this ultimately doesn't seem so hard, but you have the one platform you have to time here. And the lava there is one hit kill. If you don't make it, you're dead. Now here's another part which can trip you up if you don't know what to do. These traps only spawn if you trigger the second block there. And as you can see, they are very hard to dodge. Now in general, these skulls are pretty easy. Just don't run. Now after the second floor though, the game gives you quite a breather in that the third floor itself is very easy. All you have to do in this room, for example, is just not hold the A button down for too long, and that's about it. Now, this room here is also pretty easy, you just have to run the entire time. Now, these Wario Balls here could give you some amount of problems if they're clustered with two together, but on the whole they are kind of predictable. Now, I would like to say one thing I don't really show off in this video because I didn't find out until later. You can actually kill the boss in one spin jump. Now, as for Wario as a boss fight himself, Wario is kind of an easy boss fight. His main form of attack is trying to um is trying to hurt you with these potions by ground pounding it so the potions fall on you. Now, Wario has three phases and each phase takes three hits. One way to absolutely cheese these phases is by just having the bunny hats. Now Wario here has still the same strategy of ground pounding, but now he can fly. But... Yeah. At the bunny hat it is very easy. Just ignore the mushroom because you most likely will still have the bunny hat if you tried it like this. And Wario is just down. He is a very easy final boss in general. Now, I'm just going to shut up and let you guys just enjoy the credits for here. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it.